It will the Raps and Kush band. The album is Ultra Rears. That one is called Drive Me Crazy. Actually, it comes from Jay Will and the Raps and Kush band. Love your life, all right? Um, check those albums out if you ain't got them. Listen, I want to thank you all so much for rocking with me. Had to hop on this evening. You know, I mean, some dear folks say, "Oh, you gotta hop on and do a, you know, the birthday show." But the truth is, it's just about saying thank you first of all. You know, I've had a lot of people come on and say, "Hey, happy birthday!" and the whole night. We don't take anything for granted. Every single day we come out, we say, listen, enjoy to the fullest, all right? Enjoy life to the fullest, especially in this day and age and this time when, you know, tomorrow is never promised, but right about now, it's a little bit more abysmal with everything going on out there. So we're celebrating what we got. We're celebrating what we can. You know what I'm saying? So I just want to say thank you to everybody that's celebrating with me. All the hundreds of happy birthday shout outs. And um, for those people, hit me up on WhatsApp. Too. It ain't just about, yo, this is what's coming on social media and whatnot, not, 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 right? Thank you so much for the calls, for the, the personal calls, for, um, for, for, for the, the WhatsApps, for the texts, for everything. All right, I appreciate it. Don't take it for granted at all. Means a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. All right, all the people who made an effort to make sure say, they reach out and them, you know what I mean? Make the day special and all that, you know what I mean? You see me, I do my adjustments in thing. You know what I'm saying? Go get my adjustments in. Got a big up, I want to big up the UK. I want to big up the England soccer team. You know what I mean? Things happen, man. You know, you, and, and when I talk about England, I got to talk like this. You know what I mean? I got to resonate. I got to connect with my people. You know what I mean? I got to pick up Raheem Sterling and him. You know what I mean? Do what they do. They fell a little bit short, but you don't know. When I go on wicked, all right? All kind of crazy things happening out there. If that was happening in Jamaica, man, they would have said we crazy. But it's all, 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 all good. Listen, thank you all again very, very much. We're just dropping some G-Code joints uh, for the rest of the program. You know what I mean? Just, just, a, just a short one. But thank you so much. Here's the thing. I'm on the road right now. You know, you know, you go, we traveling. Got to be out here doing what we do. And I'm on the road right now. And it's a challenge when you go through scenarios and situations, especially being far away from home. You know, this one, I'm, I'm hitting the big four three today. And this one is a little challenging because, you know, this one is a little different for me because, you know, but for some reason, you know, I just woke up in a different element. I think maybe it's just because I'm away from home. Away from fam and all that. And, of course, I met the big four three. And my brother Bones was near and dear to me. You know, I lost him at age 42. So I think it's a little strange feeling. He's my older brother. My one only brother. My older, my older brother. So he, you know, he's two years older than me. And it's always been that case, you know. So it's, it was a little strange, a little weird for me to be hitting 43. And he didn't. I don't know if I'm making any sense, but that's kind of the vibe I got up in this morning. But the show goes on, you know what I mean? Life goes on, the day goes on, work goes on, everything goes on. But I just had to send some love up to him and for him. And, you know, but it was a strange feeling. My brother Bones, Karim, you know, celebrating 4 3. And not getting ready to celebrate four or five for him. So it was a little bit, a little, a little, I don't want to say sad, but a little, a little bit of melancholy in there. But here's what I will say. Good people, good folks, get them in your life if you ain't got them. So I thank you, Lord, for my family, for my wife, for my, my daughter, for, for the homies, man, for my, for my, 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 my brothers, for my another mother, my mother-in-law, everybody, Rachel, you know, I'm out here on the road and there's just people who will not allow you to feel like you're alone. They're not going to allow you to not enjoy that moment. You know what I mean? And it doesn't go unappreciated. And especially, here's the deal. Let this soak in. Those people who are going all out of their way, taking that time out, spreading that love to make sure you feel great on a special day when they have their own things dealing with turmoil with health issues all kinds of stuff going on but that ain't stopping it from morning till evening from sunrise till sunset riding making sure that that smiles on your face and i don't take those things for granted you know what i mean i am eternally eternally grateful um my family at home that make sure that they stay connected and make sure that hey gee we got you you know what i mean how are you you know the, the gifts coming to the hotel, going down to the hotel lobby and having stuff there. I'm not the biggest birthday celebrating dude, so a lot of things I'm not expecting. So to go down to the lobby and have stuff there for me, just, you know what I mean? It, 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 it's, it's, it, it tugs on the heartstring because, again, 
one, not expecting it, two, just so much going on right now for folks to take a minute out of their time to focus on you. Another thing is going looking at it right about now, and I can't say what's up and thank you to everybody, but hundreds, hundreds of messages on social media saying happy birthday, I don't take it for granted. You know what I mean? Especially in a time when it's a time of me. Everybody's me, 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 me. I want to say everybody, obviously, not all of us, because y'all are taking a moment right now to celebrate somebody outside of yourselves. But we are in an era, in a time, in a climate of the me time. I ain't talking about the Me Too movement. I'm talking about the me, the self. It's all about me, right? And for people to take a minute to acknowledge and say, hey, what up? Happy birthday. The phone calls, all of that. You know what I'm saying? All of that. I appreciate y'all, man. Big time, big time, big time. And again, you know, as the days go by, I'll get up and something will cross my mind and I'll say a prayer. I grew up with a, my grandma, saying as big of yourself, was a praying grandma, right? I have never made eye contact with my grandma and I pray I didn't come out of it, right? And I was always the baby of the bunch. So when I'm there with grandma, grandma put me down up to when she, two years probably before she died. And my grandma died at a, what, 102, something like that, right? I got caught in the mix where she's praying and I'm right there. And once her hand goes on my head, I can't move. So I got to endure that, that long prayer. Like a grandma prayer ain't short, right? So as a result of that, that passed down to me and not a day goes by when I don't say prayers on my own. And um, for different things, you know, you turn on the news, you see things. I'll be driving down the street, I see things. Things cross my mind, I pray, you know what I mean? I got friends that are going through their own struggle and every time I, I get a moment, I pray. And that's why I know they're going to be okay too. You going to be okay, right? Because um, I got a hookup, I got a connection with the man up top, the man upstairs and my prayers, we don't, they don't go to voicemail, they go straight through, right? Straight through. So just saying the prayers, and, 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 and I implore everybody out there, take a minute every now and then to pray, not just for yourself, but pray for somebody else. Pray for all the people out there who need. You don't have to drop no names. There are people out there who need encouragement. There are people out there who need uplifting. There are people out there who need strength, right? And I got to big up all the strong, strong, strong people, the strong women, the strong men out there that are dealing with a whole bunch of things that you would not know. A whole bunch of things that you would not know. All right? When I say I admire, I respect, I appreciate, I love from the bottom of my heart, man. All right? Trooper and through stuff, the smile every day, get up just toiling like it ain't nothing, but going through your own struggles means a lot, means a lot, means a lot. All right? And for all the people who are on the other side of that spectrum that's making much ado about nothing, you know what I mean? Like I said, I got folks in my life that are going through real deals, and then I got people out there whining and complaining about nothing. You know what I mean? Some little thing happening. Ah, you're tripping. Nah, nah, we don't do that. We don't do that. So I want to big up all the beautiful ladies out there. I want to big up all the fellas doing what they do. And I, you know what I wish for everybody out there? That y'all got lovely people in their lives like I do. People with hearts of gold. Check this one out. It's from the album. All right. It's called Heart of Gold. How big. This is for my baby. It's called Heart of Gold, ladies and gentlemen. The album is Ocho Rios. You know, it's amazing. We got to speak certain things into being, but we also got to honor, we have to cherish, we got to acknowledge the good things that are out there and the good things that happen to us, right? Um, a lot of times good things happen in your life and you're afraid to speak about it, you're afraid to, 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 to share it, to, to, to proclaim the, 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 the gravity and the magnitude of the goodness that's going on with you because you don't want somebody to say, oh, it might show off, you know what I mean? It's sad that we got to get to that place where, again, you know, you got to, listen, don't apologize for your success. Again, I'm not saying a glow tend to show off on people and look down on people, but if there's good, proclaim that good. Especially since we spend so much time proclaiming the bad. If something bad happens to you, be talking about it, right? Some good happened to you, sing the praises, man. Somebody been good to you, sing the praises. You know, when when this song came out, got a big up um reggae upon the river. I got a big up uh Reggae on the radio. I got to big up a, a lot of the, the, the stations over there in, in Italy because this song was one of those that did well for me in Italy. And funny, I did an interview and they were talking about the words of the song and loving the song because of just what it says, you know. It, it was a lady that was doing the interview and she was saying, you know, you know, men don't proclaim how they feel. It, it's always machismo, you know what I mean? It's always, it's always that overly exerted masculinity you know what i mean to some point you may even call it 
Um, you know, maybe not. Maybe we won't, we won't call it that. You know what I mean? But sometimes it's a bit much. Um, but, but when it comes to the affairs of the heart, because of yourself, Junior Gang, and the real deal, sometimes we don't speak on stuff like that. So she was talking about just the fact that we talk about a kiss. That's what she was saying, a kiss. You know what I mean? Lips so sweet and a heart of gold. She was saying that in itself is so beautiful and so endearing, which I appreciated, right? I appreciate it very much. But I did have to correct her. And this goes out to all the ladies out there who pour, you know, had a conversation with Roy Sweetland before, and he was talking about pouring back into the well, you know what I mean? Think about that figuratively speaking. If you keep taking out of the well, taking out of the well, no matter what they tell you, the well's going to run dry, right? So sometimes the proverbial, the figurative well, we got to put more water back into the well. So what I have to let her know pretty much is when I say lips so sweet and a heart of gold, I'm not talking about a kiss. I'm talking about speaking the best, speaking life, speaking prosperity, speaking growth, speaking eternity, speaking strength into that significant other. And especially for the fellas out there, let me tell you something. Most of the successful men out there are the strongest men, the strongest male personalities that you see out there. That strength is coming from the woman beside them. Many of us are behind them, you know, beside them. Speaking that strength into them. You know what I mean? Not emasculating, not taking from what's speaking that strength into them. And sometimes people would be like, well, as men, do you really need that? Yeah. Yeah, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. You get shot out in these streets. You get ran over in these streets. You get beat up in these streets and recover from that way quicker than being broken down at home, right? So, ladies, trust me, you got more power than you think you do. And that particular one was me saying, hey, thank you so much for those lips so sweet, which is speaking those sweet words, speaking that life, speaking that prosperity, speaking that greatness, speaking that strength into me. And of course, where does it come from? From a heart of gold. You know what I mean? So it comes across as a love song, as a vibe there. And I appreciate that. And guess what? Sometimes that's what we do as artists. We put it to where, you know, those double entendres come forth, you know? And um, you see it for what it is and what you think it is. It's art. It's like poetry, right? It's a little abstract. You know, A means A, but it could mean something else, right? So when people said, hey, so sweet, so endearing, so romantic, I appreciated that too. But you know what? Again, speak life. Speak life, speak life, speak life. Especially ladies. Let me tell you, so ladies, you got power. When I talk about in the loins, like them tell you. you say, yes, you do. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Yes, you do. But I'm talking about that power, that strength, right? That power, that strength. Kings, kings, kings. Ain't no reigning king having no effect without that reigning queen. You understand? So ladies, big up on yourself. All right? Big up yourselves. We got you covered. And I'm going to drop that one one more time because I got the messages coming in right about and I said, what? I wasn't thinking about it that way. One more time. I got you covered. Okay? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, coming to you from the album Ocho Rios. I want to drop in some joints today because, you know, like I did an episode before about not taking an, uh, the chance to, you know, to... So to enjoy the moment and to, to, to live in the now and, you know, even when we drop these records, we're out, drop the album, we're out promoting and traveling or whatever the case may be. But sometimes we don't get a chance to sit back and, and, um, and live it and enjoy it. And, you know, I've, I, I, I ended up going through some of the messages, some of the responses, some of the feedback I'd gotten from the records and, you know, I just want to say thank you all so much to everybody out there that has supported Raps and Coach, has supported G. Cole out there, has supported just the music in general, live music scene in South Florida, reggae music scene. I appreciate you. Big up all the bands out there, Army Gideon, you know what I mean? Mixed culture, everybody doing what they do. Um, it's a big deal. Code Red, you know, everybody doing what they do. And all the artists out there still putting out good music and putting out that work, man. I appreciate y'all big time, big time, big time. But like I said earlier, you know, with us, with us, with us reigning in that positivity and, um, you know, talking about people enduring their struggles, enduring what they're going through. Yo, when I say ladies, props, all right? And like I said, you know, I get the convo all the time about the little things that are happening. And it, it is human. It goes on. But what me tell you say, much love, much respect, much honor to the strong troopers out there who are going through it, going through it, going through it. All right? Um, I want you all, if you can, for me, to go out. I'm going to do an episode of the show. We're going to talk about some 
we're going to talk to some strong folks, some strong people going through some stuff right now. I, I, I know a couple of people who have dealt with like kidney failures and have to go through like uh, kidney transplants and stuff like tough stuff to go through. Um, and it's something we're going to get into because we need a lot of people who are in positions to, you know, donate. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's a challenge when, when you think about donating organs and them something. But a lot of times you have people out there who have donated organs to people who they have, they don't necessarily know. It's not necessarily a family member or whatnot, because bear in mind, not because you're a family member means you're a match. But if you are capable of it, just go do the research. You know what I mean? Google, check with um, your local kidney foundations and stuff like that and see what you can do, how you can contribute, right, um, to, 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 to what's going on. Because I'm going to tell you, say, um, much love, much respect, much honor to, the, to, to people who are just coping and just troopering it through and doing what they do. All right? When we say doing what they do, they're doing what they do. Much love, much respect. Big up. All right? Now, again... Thank you all so much for the birthday love, man. Thank you all so much for the birthday love. Being away from home, um, it's, it's tough, but getting all the love from home and from 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 you know my road family, it's it's a joy. It's a joy. You know what I mean? Is it cool to ask a man his age? I don't know about nobody else, but for me, I am in. You know what I mean? I got one or two grades coming up here. I hit the big four three today. You know what I mean? The big four three. All right, a big four three. All right, um, I got three grays protruding out here. So once the four came and then the three come, boom, boom, boom. All right, the big four three. And I'm just grateful for this gift of life, man. Especially again, you know, amazingly enough, within the last year, maybe two, the amount of folks that we've lost. You know, there's a time when people used to grow old, and you expected, you know, losing somebody young was the anomaly, right? Doesn't happen every day, but you know, ill things do happen in this, in, in, this, in this realm of life. Now, people just gone. We're just losing folks. You know what I mean? So, um, generally, I'm not even the birthday celebrating type of guy. But, you know, I'm going to throw it up on this one. You know what I mean? And I want to thank everybody who has been not just an inspiration, but have been a part of the journey thus far. Um, whether personal, professional, whatever the case may be. Those that come and go, I appreciate you. Everybody serves a purpose, you know what I mean? Some come for a reason, some come for a season, and some come for a lifetime. But regardless, they came, all right? So I appreciate you. It's the Grassroots Rhythm, ladies and gentlemen. It's called Walking in the Rain. I got to get up out of here. I want to thank you all so much for rocking out, man. Everybody, all the phone calls coming in, the ones I could answer, the ones I could not, all right? I appreciate you all big time. When I say big time, I mean big time. It means a lot, more than words could say. I want to take a minute, of course, to big up all the people who've you know, all the musicians, all the producers, everybody we've worked with throughout the years who've shown love, man. From then till now. Purpose Chung. All right. God can big up yourself. All right. Art Twizzle. Juanito. All right. Junior Butler. You know what I mean? The geniuses, man, that we've worked with over the years. Stephen Murphy. You know what I'm saying? Uh, again, that's a Purpose Chung. We said J. Will. We said Jayut. Ferna Burner. You know what I mean? Gamal Father G. A lot of folks, man. J. Bass, B. Will, Kevo Gitz, Vinnie Hamilton. You know what I'm saying? That's just, just, just everyone. J. Vibe, Zimrai, Shata, everyone. Dave Simmons, everyone. Stephen Lashley, everyone. All right? We appreciate you big time. Clive Davidson, everyone. Everyone. I'm going to say everyone, everyone. All right? Mr. Danny Breckenridge, everyone. Everyone, everyone, all the people who've given us the opportunity to partake in their projects, you know what I mean, to contribute to their projects, I appreciate you all so much, all right? Don't take anything for granted. All right, we got a lot of stuff coming out. And again, I'll keep you posted. Remember, hit us up on social media at my G Cole, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter at my G Cole, all right? We got all kind of things in store for you, man. When I say all kind of things, I mean all kinds of things, all right? And, um... If, if you haven't yet subscribed to the, to, the, to the podcast, please do. It's Homegrown with G Cole. It's available on iTunes, Spotify, TuneIn, Stitcher, Google Play, iHeartRadio, Radio.com, YouTube, wherever listening to your podcast, where there are. We listen to some great music. We talk to some great people. It's always a vibe. Follow us on, um, on YouTube also. All right, hit us up on YouTube, Homegrown with G Cole. Always some energy, always some vibes going on. Big up AJ Brown. I want to big up Mr. Richard Daly. All right, the legendary Richard Daly from the legendary Third World, BS player. Um, one of those people who encouraged me and us as a band coming up. You know what I mean? It, it's, it's a joy to have some of the legends, the OGs, playing on your debut project. You know what I mean? Your first project, having faith in you. And that means a lot. 
Ruption from Third World also. And of course, Mr. Willie Stewart, the Mr. Willie Stewart. Thank you so much right, for blessing up the project. It means a lot. When I say it means a lot, it means a lot. Especially in this day and age when, again, we say people are, you know, people got their own legacies to protect and project. You know what I mean? So when people decide, nah, I like what you're doing, keep doing what you're doing, and, um, you know, and show so much love and so much interest that, you know, they see the growth, see the work, and decide, you know what, I'm going to bless you with my thing too. You know what I'm saying? I don't take it for granted. Appreciate y'all. Appreciate y'all. Appreciate y'all. Again, hit me up on social media because we've got a lot of stuff coming up and I want to keep you abreast of that. Make sure you know what's coming out, when it's coming out. All right. Again, music coming out, some literature coming out and a whole lot more. Um, spend some time doing theater too. Want to big up Margaret. You know what I mean? Want to big up everybody, man, who, who, who quam me, everybody who was on that circuit. Um, Love Knows No Boundaries, the play. We did that one, going to the Bahamas and all over, traveling, doing that play. It was a blast. All right. Uh, you know what? Take me off two of them DVD and I might give you a D I might give away a DVD. You get this a G Cole on stage. All right. Getting his thespian on. All right. I appreciate y'all. Big time. Big time. Big time. I must get up out of here though. All right. I gotta be on my Ultra Rius Massive. That is home. Ultra Rius Jamaica, where everything was nurtured. Um, the place that was responsible for whatever you're getting today. All right. So that's the reason why I had to title that album Ultra Race. I had to show my love and my affinity for my hometown and just, you know, write a love song for Ultra Race because I'm in love with Ultra Race and will always be. So we got Ultra Massive, Ultra Race Primary School. You know what I'm saying? Got to be up Fern Court High School, Prospect College. Got to be up all of that. Everybody, everybody, everybody. All right. Everybody. All my folks I grew up with. Rest in peace, Mom Dukes. Rest in peace, Bones. You know what I mean? Big up again, everybody. Don't take it for granted. The big four, three, the big four, three, the big four, three. All right. Hitting that up today. The big four, three. All right. Um, again, thanks for all the birthday wishes. We're going to ride up with Ultra Race Joint. All right. Again, means a lot, means a lot, means a lot. You know, the highs and the lows. Uh, today was a roller coaster one. Again, start off a little bit um, melancholic, you know, but um, thanks, of course, to all the people who show love and share love. Got great, you know. Um, and we're feeling good, feeling good. And we look forward to another year around the sun. All right. Thanks, of course, to the Almighty for blessing me with breath. You know, um, a beautiful family, friends, good folks. You know what I mean? Trust me. Trust me. All the people who came and hung out with us on 4th of July, you know, close friends, close family. It was a joy, man. You know what I mean? It was a joy. It was a joy. It was a joy. Um, my plans, you know, Megado, as often as I possibly can. I have some good times. I'm a chill. Fire up. That. I'm not talking about, I'm not want to go to a road thing. I'm talking about at home. Make home the sanctuary. I'm going to fire up the grill more often. I'm going to have my loved ones there more often. My godchildren there more often. My nieces, my nephews more often. My father more often. And we're going to kick it. You know what I mean? Joey, my daughter, my right hand. You know what I mean? It's been times when it's just me and you. Right? I got you. All right. Always. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Ultra Race. It's about my time. I love y'all, man. I appreciate y'all. Back, 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 back music. Oh, 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 oh.